Hello, hello there. Melissa here coming on tonight once again to do another passage reading day 16 for the pivot year. 365 days to become the person you truly want to be. Um, today was a great day. Um, I'm back to, I was able to hop on, do my Zoom full snow moon meditation tonight. It was really, that was fantastic. That just just I just love it. I missed my doing my meditation since my surgery, but it was great getting back on. Met some even some other new people came on tonight with the regulars of like Kim and John. Um, but it was really nice, great uh, meditation that came through tonight. Once again, I channeled them all, so it was just another heal, another beautiful healing going in and healing meditation. So it was great. So I just came off that, and I'm going to do my fun reading now, being in my great mood now. And um, so here we go. I'll jump into day 16 of the passage reading. So here we go. You may fear the quiet times in your life when your soul goes through a winter. However, it's often those same times when, when the most profound and human work of all is being completed. Be still and do nothing. It is both the quiet and the noise that writes the symphony, the blank canvas and the paint that makes the picture, the rest and the movement that gives you the wisdom, insight, and clarity to press forward more boldly than ever before. That's awesome. That's, uh, it's, that's interesting. It's uh, in between like a meditation going in silent. It's almost like kind of my, my journey in essence where I, in January, I went inwards and more quiet with my 28 day detox, detox I had and going inwards to the quiet times of, of me going inwards and what's coming up for me to be healed. And then um, it's both the quiet times and the noise that gives you, keeps us, it paints the canvas in our life. What's going on? What's going to happen next? How are we transforming? How are we moving forward? So that's kind of cool because it does, does give us the insight and clarity going inwards. Um, and then allows us to press forward and move forward in new ways, new exciting ways that as our soul transforms and moves and uplifts and upshifts and enlightens us with more wisdom as we go through these times and changes that bring through the great evolutionary changes on our pathway in life, which I just love those notions. Um, but yeah, we don't need to fear those quiet times. That's when we need to go in and we can really go into our heart and our soul and, and, and be aware of what's, what's coming up for us, what's, what what are we being shown from our from within our heart, our our deep within our our subconscious? It's all there in our I was sharing our cells, all waiting to be discovered. It's it's there. Once we quiet our minds down and allow it to come up, we can we're being shown a lot as well, and we're getting answers that way. When we get busy and crazy, sometimes if we're not having our awareness to go inwards to hear what truly needs to be shown to us to give us those answers. Um, so when we pay attention to that, we can get our, get the answers we're searching for, which is pretty amazing. Just like meditation, so much healing and visions, words, or knowings can come up and show you things of that needs your attention or also is ready to be healed. Just witness, see it, feel it, let it go. And as we're letting these stagnant emotions go, we're making much more room in our heart for so much more love. And I love that. That's one of my favorite phrases as well with meditation and going in to the stillness to get answers. So today, once again, today was a great day. Got my meditation in. Actually, Sue took me for a drive back to, to Freelton to my place. So I just picked up a few more things and uh, just some extra, extra clothes and a few fun things to, to bring back here. And uh, yeah, we're going to go down and probably watch another fun episode of Lucifer because we do that now when... <laughs> Here is someone who already watches TV now is taking it totally easy and and uh, enjoying just uh, sitting back and enjoying something different. But it's kind of funny how it's it seems to be Lucifer and the you know the light and the dark the cool spiritual things that I talk about every day in my daily life. Ah, it's just normal stuff now. So I wish everybody a great night and um, hope you had a great day today as well. Got out in the sunshine. It was chillier, but it was beautiful sun. And uh, once again, please like and subscribe to this channel so we get these fun messages out there and share these fun words and, uh, and everything. Yeah, so take care and have a great night. Bye-bye.